Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So today, in yesterday's video, I told you about the three days I'm going to school with the rest of, um, the, well, all the years are going in. So, yeah, but we have set days. So our year is going in Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and it's late afternoon, Tuesday, and I'm going to show you what I'm going to be packing for lunch tomorrow. It will be nice and fresh because we're going to keep it in the fridge. And um, I'm putting an ice pack type thing um, for it to stay cool while I'm at school. <laughs> Whoa, that actually rhymes, to so stay cool while I'm at school. I like it. So I'm going to start off by preparing the main course, which is just going to be a good old cheese sandwich. Now, I have two slices of bread, but over here I have my cheese. Now, I think I have six slices, but they're only small. So that's why but what I'm going to do is I'm going to use my leaf shape cookie cutter and I'm going to punch out a kind of leaf shape if I can as best I can anyway and I'm going to try and get the best leaf shape shapes out as I can because I want these lunches to still be fun even though I'm going into school and hopefully they will be now the leaves I'm just going to put on the sandwich. Obviously, they're not necessarily going to turn out that well. But hopefully, they'll turn out pretty good. I only press lightly on it because one of mine nearly broke and there's another. Next, I'll just eat that bit. And then you just are left with plenty of little bits of cheese to put on the sandwich. So all that's going to go on. Now it didn't turn out the best but never mind. Anyway I'm going to get a regular knife. And I'm just going to first, well no, first I'm going to get my cheese on because that will be best. So I'm going to put all these little leaves on. Leaves of cheese. I include all these little tiny bits as well. It's a bit like a sprinkled cheddar cheese sandwich type thing. You know when you get grated cheese. Or shredded cheese as some people might call it. I'm just going to cut this sandwich in half. Okay you guys, this really did not turn out that well. Half of the sandwich, half of the sandwich has just come a little bit undone. But still, it's a pretty good sandwich overall. Just going to eat the tip bits that are left. Okay. Okay, so I'm not just going to put this sandwich straight in the box because this is going to like kind of top right. I'm going to get some of this um, kitchen foil here. Foil that you would use to put sandwiches on. I'm just going to get a little bit of that. And on the non shiny side, I'm going to place my sandwiches. Okay, and I'm going to fold it up. Like that. And I might fold it up better afterwards. I'm not actually sure whether that's going to fit on. On my idea, in fact, yes, it should. Let me just check. It should, hopefully, hopefully. Okay, then I'm going to actually get the lunchbox and get some silicone liners. I'm not, I think I'm going to stick with a square type thing today. But no, I'm going to use different colours for my silicone liners. So I'm just going to get a couple different shapes. I do like mixing things up a bit. It's just really nice. 
And I just, yeah, I just really like it. Now I'm firstly just going to add a blue little silicone liner and it's a rectangle one to the box. And I'm just going to add, if I can get them, <laughs> just a few whole tomatoes or tomatoes, like that. Then I'm going to add a purple one next to it. This is a square one. And next to it, the same knife as I used to cut the sandwich, I'm going to just cut this block of cucumber. Now it's not a sharp knife to cut cucumber with, don't you worry. I'm just going to cut my cucumber. And if my friends are watching this, then they are going to see me eat this at school, or at least the people in my bubble group will, because we have to have like this bubble group at school, because just so we can like stay two meters well. So yeah, we just need to stay two meters away, just because of coronavirus. So in the purple square one, I'm going to add my cucumber chunks. Then I'm going to get a pinkish type one and a green circle one. Put them both in there. And I'm going, in one of them, I'm going to add some raspberries. And in another, I'm just going to bring over some grapes, but I'm going to cut them in half because I know grapes can be a choking hazard. So I am going to cut them in half. just so it can be nice and safe. I'm going to add these grapes into the lunchbox. So you can see like a fruit and veg lunchable going on here. And it just looks so good. I cannot wait to eat this because I do love healthy. Now to go along with the cucumber and maybe tomatoes if I want to, I'm going to get my little dips in a treat container. And I'm going to add a bit of ketchup in there. I need to make sure to add enough because they do not have ketchup in school. So I will not be able to get more then. That is a lot of ketchup. But, you know, just like to be safe. I don't want to put, I don't want to pack um, less in because if I need ketchup, I'm sure school won't have them. So if I can get this little dip container to fit down here, that'll be pretty good. But I'm not sure. No, I can't because that won't fit on top. So that might just have to go on the side. Then I'm going to put this little thing on top and add the sandwich, which then I'm going to try and squeeze on top the lid. <laughs> Can I actually even get this one to go on? Ah, there we go, that is a very tight lunchbox and I might have the air plucker like that. Now, but I am going to undo this because don't forget I have the ice pack to add it in. So I'm going to put that over there for now though. And then to go on the side, I've got my ketchup and I'm also going to be sending in a packet of these breadsticks. I'm not sure whether I'm going to send a Capri Sun to go in with this. I might just send a bottle of juice or something. So yeah. Let me just see if I can shut this blind because it seems to be quite sunny. It's already shut. Now I'm going to have to shut it fully. <laughs> I hope it's not too dark. Well, at least you can see my face. It's not that whiter now. And um, this isn't as whiter now. Well, not as white. Now, where am I going to add? It's not so cold, cold compressed. It's actually a cold compressed. But um, I like to use it as an ice pack. So I could either put it on top of the fruit. But I think I'm going to put this on top of under the sandwich, actually. a sandwich like that and I've got those to go along with it and then I can just pop the ketchup and the lunchbox in the fridge obviously the breadsticks don't go in the fridge don't put them in the fridge that'd be um, not too sensible but I've got my ketchup and my that and my lunch and also go watch my um what's in my pencil case video which I am about to upload I think maybe after this one or maybe before this one I'm not sure no, in fact, I'll probably upload the pencil case video, then I'll upload this one. But yes, I think I've got enough ketchup. I always worry that I haven't, but I never eat all of it, so 
I think I've got plenty. Right, I'm just going to go pop this in the fridge. So I'll be right back. Okay, now that's in the fridge, we've obviously got the breadsticks and things like that. So I'm just going to get um, anything that I don't need like, in the dishwasher. I'm just going to put, oh no, we don't want to put a wipe in the um, dishwasher. Oh, dishwasher, it's a sink. <laughs> okay. Um, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below. And if, if, and if you like these videos, click that notification bell so you don't miss out on any of my videos. I hope you enjoyed. Bye!